we've come to somewhere new that Dave found yesterday that's probably never ever been fished because of its what it is and the location. But straight away we've got a 10 p coin. James got some handcuffs. He's got a big piece of cast pipe. He's got that. <coughs> Pull that out. And we've looked lower down and there's absolutely loads in it. Nice little fork just come out, just stay out back. No, there you go. Nice old hammerhead. <laughs> it's on the summit big. That, I can tell you, is heavy. Very heavy. Good fishing here. It's teeming. Hundreds and hundreds of them. Jason's just got this. Weird container. Um, could be for drugs or looks like a pepper pot, but it's a weird one. And a union lock and two of them ultimate bars. Thing, isn't it? Jay's just got himself what looks like a trampoline or a bed spring. Big long scaffy tube. There. Jay's on again. Solid bar. Here's a solid bar. Giant rebar, isn't it? Weird. God knows what it is. So Jay's brother's just found this that looks like somebody's rigged it up theself as a double magnet. But we need something to test it on. Let's have a look. Slightly. Slight, slightly magnetic. But the idea's alright. Bracket, that kind of bracket and that thing. So yeah, somebody could possibly make one of storm tunnels here. He just pulled out a dozen scaff clamps here. Another big bear there. So we've now got as far as where we joint river. You can see it goes right up that way. That's where it joins the river, other side of there. As you can see. And then it comes right up here. So, we've magnet fished about a 400 yard stretch. And the amount of stuff we've pulled out is just like crazy. Nice girder. We've got a storm drain cover here. It's completely off. Another girder. Tape measure over there. I get wall. 
scaff clamps we've probably had 20 or 30 if not more absolute stacks of these more bar more scaffy clamps you can see the bottom there's absolutely tons of fish swimming in it which is surprising and then it goes on a loop it up, up this way this will be where storm covers from just here that one that's blown off that'll be off there So carrying on, more scaff bars, scaff bars, there's a bank card here, whether or not this will lift it's another thing. No, but you can see there, someone's bank card. So we're walking further up now. Another scaff clamp. Storm drains that have got doors on the back of them. Four of them. Recorder levels there, so you can see the electronic box goes up to the top. Further up now, walking up towards old Albeck Viaduct. And you can see plenty of stuff left. It's all over. We've got a date on here that says 1849. Millions of people will drive past that and never even see it. Well, scrap. So they're going to try and arrange for scrap man to come down during it week and then get a day with him, collect it all into one big pile and get it all out. But you can see there's old Albeck Viaduct. They're hoping to turn it into a public walkway just up there. Boys are back up and we've done full length that's accessible of the Holbeck as it's called, Holbeck which is where Holbeck gets its name from 
Uh, we've had found some interesting bits, uh, and as you can see, it dates back to um, well mid 1800s. So yeah, good little explore.